Hello to my YouTube friends. It's Spectacular, the Silver Stacular. Today I have some really cool mail. I, I don't know who all this is from. Um, I want to get into it. I want to see what's going on here. So I have three envelopes and I have a package and the package has some tape all over it and it's uh, it's big. It's a priority mail. Um, man, these are expensive. This costs like seven bucks just to ship this thing. Well, seven ninety is what it says up here. So let's get into it. Let's figure out what's going on. All right, I'm going to start off with the yellow one. And now I'm looking through it. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. Hold on. I'm going to show you. You can see, I know who this is right here. This, I guarantee, is H-Town Stacker. I can see the, the outline of the sticker. So here he is, his sticker right there. Looks like he sent me some more stickers. Let's see what's going on in here. Wow. You know, I'm notorious for doing terrible, terrible openings when it comes to friend mail. And like, yeah, like somebody said, you don't even need a knife when it comes to this stuff. And I get that. But it's not fun to not have something sharp in your hand when you're opening things. It's just not fun, you know? All right, here we go. I'm all about the fun. I'm a fun-loving dude. So let's see. Holy smokes, this guy sent me everything. Wow, he has a really, really cool new sticker. Woo! Look at that. That's really, really cool. Man, that's a good-looking sticker. So I like that, H-Town. That is really, really cool. Whoa. Whoa, that is that is fancy. I have that one. I have the OG. Oh, it's a magnet. No, it's not even a sticker. It's an OG magnet. That's cool. This man's moving up. Look at all the stuff he's got. He's got this sticker with the skull and then the little devil horns with his hand there. Whoa, dropped it. And then you got the H-Town sticker right there, the baseball. Let me get that one I dropped. Ooh. All right. So I got the one that I dropped. What does this say? Little card. Spectacular. Appreciate the sticker trade and added a magnet too. Hope you enjoy H-Town Stacker. Cool. So that's awesome. Man, he's got... That one's a cool one. I'm sorry, H-Town. Everything's cool, but this is really, really cool. That's a really nice sticker, man. Woo! H-Town. So H-Town does some stuff on the Instagram. Check him out. Alright, what's next? Um, I gotta get into this thing. I gotta see what's in this box. This box is driving me crazy, and I don't know where to start on it because it's like taped here and a little bit of everywhere. Let's see. Uh, this one's gonna be razor knife. This one. I'm gonna use razor knife. And we're gonna get right into it. I think if I do it here, hey, this is probably like a real simple way to open these priority boxes. But um, whatever. I'm spectacular. I'm the weirdest dude you're ever gonna see when it opening stuff. All right, so opening, opening, opening. Hopefully, there's no personal information that they don't want me to know about in this. There's a letter. It has all kinds of stuff in there. It's heavy. It is heavy. Okay, <clears throat> so let's see. Please read fully on camera, thanks. Well, here we go. I'm nervous. Hold on. Wait, I'm nervous. My, let me check my pulse. Okay, yeah, it's kind of high. It's kind of high. I'm nervous. Nervous. Jeez, I've got to read. That's a, lot of, that's a lot of reading. All right, I'm going to do my best to not mess it up, too. Sometimes you start reading and you kind of mess up. Anyways. Uh, hey, Spectacular, the Silver Stacular. Kelly R. Hartman here. You and the World Wide Web Internet know me as Hats Goods. Today I am writing to you to say thank you. Thanks for your videos on YouTube and the way you do your content that I love. So, on that note, as a token of just a thank you, I have included some stuff in this package slash letter. Some of the stuff is for a giveaway that you can do, and the other stuff is just for you to keep. I will mark slash label what stuff is for what. Also, if anyone likes, would like to email me for anything for coin-related stuff, they are more than welcome to. My email that they can email me is, and that's the email, what is it, N, is it N-I-P-Y-R-O girl 29? Anyways, there it is. Check it out. Keep that in mind. Come back to it if you need to come back to it. Um, so for anyone wondering why my email handle is what it is, my other main hobby is I do professional fireworks. So all I ask in return from you is a YouTube channel sticker and a magnet of yours. I am trying to get more subscribers. 
As of now, I am 171 subscribers. It's pretty good. It's a good start. With great hopefulness, I am wishing to get to at least 190, but ideally 200. Whenever I hit 200 or more subs, we'll do a giveaway of some coins. For the sticker that you'll give me, I will be putting it on my coin book slash binder to make on the front cover of the binder book that is currently blank and boring to make it livelier. As for the magnet, I just love your logo slash channel picture. I think that it's really cool. So on that note, I have included a stamped envelope with my address already on it. So all you have to do is put the magnet and sticker in the envelope and send it on its way. I have put two stamps inside the envelope, so I'm not sure if one stamp will do it, but sure two will do it, so you only need one. Please keep the other stamp for another time when you might need to send something out to someone and use it on me or someone else. So keep up the great work with your content and your videos. So in ending this letter, thanks once again, Coin Lady, Hats, Goods, Kelly. All right, cool. Wow, we made it. Fantastic. So Kelly needs, let's see, she has 101, or sorry, 171 subscribers. She would like to get at least 190, but she would definitely take 200 and or more. So help Kelly out, get her some subscribers. Um, sounds like she's really uh, friendly and she uh, you know, wants to do a giveaway too. So what's wrong with that? Awesome. So, okay, cool. I read that. Uh, let's see what's else. So this was the uh, self-addressed stand fin. I can't, I can't show you that. So I will hold off on that. That's that's uh, something I got to give back to her. I've already sent her a sticker and uh, magnet, but hey, what's one more? You know, right? Let's just do another one. Why not? Uh, what's whoa? Look at all this stuff. Wow. This is for the giveaway. You guys want to see the giveaway first, right? Let's see what that's all about. Hold on a second. This is cool. This is a lot of stuff. I heard it jumbling around in there. All right. So I'm going to be doing a giveaway, thanks to Hats Good, and this is some of the stuff. Okay, so you have the formative years, the 2009 uh, Lincoln um, scent right here, where he has like the little thing on the back. Hold on, let me, get, let me get closer here. So that's him on the back right there. So that'll be part of a giveaway. Um, you can have the giveaway thing that says giveaway sticker on both sides. You can have that. Um, here's another one, birth in the childhood. So that's where he has like the cabin and where he's born. So that's cool. I love those um, those one cents right there. Those where they have the little um, different backings on them from 2009. I have a bunch of those. And here is Pro Life. So cool. It's like one of each. That's fantastic. That's a good little thing. So we have some 1959 Lincoln cents. One's a Denver. One's a Philadelphia. Fantastic. Uh, what is this? That's weird looking. What is that? A bridge token. Oh, that's really cool. Where is that from? This is going to be a really, really cool little mill there. River joint. Delaware. Man, that's neat. Okay, cool. Uh, what is this one? A $2. What is that? Oh, it must be a Mexican coin, huh? Yeah. I didn't know they had something like that where it's like uh, something inside of something. That's neat. Where do you find all these from? 1957D, so that's a wheat. Um, another bridge token. Those bridge tokens are cool. It's a shame I have to give those away. <laughs> I would like to have those. There's a Queen Elizabeth, a uh, Canadian cent. Ooh, this one's pretty. That one is really pretty. What is this? A two pence, none the richer. That's a pretty coin from 1997. Man, that's nice. That's cool. What is this? A 1948 wheat scent. This is a cool coin. I think I've seen one of these before, haven't I? This is from Hong Kong. Two dollars from Hong Kong. 1983. Hey, that's when I was born. My birthday's coming up real soon, too. Crazy, crazy. Uh, Queen Elizabeth. Okay. Let me scoot this down a little bit. Hold on. I feel like I can do better if this is, this is down a little bit. Okay. And then what else? Um, another... Queen Elizabeth coin right there from Canada. Another bridge token. Those bridge tokens are really, really cool. I can see uh, Silver Heist enjoying those. Um, and a 1964 nickel. Okay. Very cool. So that's going to be 
the giveaway stuff. And wait, there's more giveaway stuff, so don't, hold on, don't hang up the phone yet. That's part of the giveaway. And then, look at all this. This is all for giveaways too. What is all this stuff? What are these? Where a kid can be a kid. <gasps> Chuck E. Cheese's! You got Chuck E. Cheese tokens? There's still Chuck E. Cheese's around here. You think they still work? Oh man, those are cool. Can't I keep one of those? Oh, I dropped one. Oops, I dropped one. I guess I won't be able to find it. I might as well just keep it. I really don't know where it went. Let me try to find it. Well, I'll find it later, I guess. Man, those are cool. I want the Chuck E. Cheese tokens. Where a kid can be a kid. Man, that's a cool thing to give away. <laughs> ah, I don't know. For a kid growing up during the, uh, you know, the, that era, I guess, with the arcades and stuff. Uh, man, I, whew, I'm a big kid now, and I like keeping cool stuff like that. But I gotta give it away. Alas. And now it says just for you. All right, let's see what just for me is. Looks like a lot. This is a, a really super generous package here. We gotta give her the subs, everybody. Hold on. There we go. Get them out of there! All right, so, uh, what is this? It's a 19, I can't see the date hardly, 1941 wheat scent. Okay, that's nice. That'll go for the collection. What is this thing? This looks a little, little rusty. Looks like it's uh, got some copper and it's been in the water, huh? Um, a half penny, 1947. Man, that's beautiful with that ship on there. Can you enjoy that? Wow. That is cool. I know it's hard to see because copper coins, when they start getting like brown and toned and stuff, and especially with it having that, uh, that greenish from the, from the copper all getting like, I guess, wet. It does that, but man, that's, that's really, really cool. That is, that's a nice piece. I like that. That is awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, a 1958 D. Okay, so that's a weedy. Um, 1945 D. No, 1945 plane. Yeah, nope. Wait, hold on. No, it's, a, it's an S. Okay, 1945 S. I guess it says it right there. I should just read that instead of actually looking at the coin. It'd probably be easier for me on camera. Um, let's see, a 1956. Ooh, man, that's a really nice condition, too. Whoa. That's a stunner right there. Look at the look at the cartwheel on that pretty little thing. Man, that's a pretty one. Ooh. Ooh. Woo. Man, Kelly, this is so nice of you. Uh 1958D. This is way generous. Let's see. 1984P. Filled P mint mark. Let's see this. Let's see what this is all about. So I guess instead of the the P having like a like an opening there. In the middle of it, you know, where like where how you would draw a P. I guess it's like filled. It's hard to see on the camera. I know, I know. Huh. That's cool. This looks very thick too, like the Liberty. That looks very thick. Interesting, huh? The whole thing kind of looks thick. Interesting. Cool. Interesting, cool, interesting, cool. I've probably said that about 10 times already. Here's a 1961 nickel. Pretty. Cool. That'll go to the collection. I actually have a collection of older nickels, too. I don't know if you've ever seen that, Hats Good. Can I call you Hats Good, or should I call you Kelly, or what? Can I call you either one? This is very nice. Thank you so much. Yeah, I have a older collection of nickels, and I just I just keep them in a little baggie, the older, older nickels I find. I figure, you know, they're not silver, but they're they're cool to find older ones, right? Here's a 1960. That'll definitely go good in the collection. And a 196. I should read it just right here. Okay, 1963. <laughs> I'm sitting there trying to read the coin, and you can't hardly see it. Through when I'm looking through the camera, I can't see this thing. Anyways, that's super awesome. So thank you. That's cool. I will definitely definitely use that for a giveaway. In fact, you know what? I have a giveaway coming up, um, the Monument Metals giveaway. I can just add those to that. That'd be fun, right? So instead of only having, what, four or five winners, whatever I ended up, uh, whatever I'm going to do with that, I think it was five winners or four winners, I can't remember. But I'll just I'll just add these right here. We'll just have more winners, more possible winners. That'll be fun. 
that'll be really fun. So everybody, go out and you know look for hats. Good. Um, let's see. There's the email if you need to get a hold of her. Um, and she does professional fireworks. I'd be really curious what those are all about. Really curious what the professional fireworks are all about. And uh, cool. Let's get her. Let's get her a little higher, right? Let's get her to that. You know the one. Let's get her past 200 if we can. All right. So look up hats goods. Hats goods on uh, on YouTube. Awesome. That was cool. That was a lot of stuff. That was a lot of stuff. So yeah, boom. More stuff to give away. Cool little packages. Man, this is really cool though. This is really cool. That. Whew, I really want some of those. Maybe if I give them away, somebody can send me one back. Okay. Let's see. I have another another letter. Let's use uh let's go let's go old school now. Let's use katana 2.1 for this, man. It's been katana has been so long. Let me give you a kiss. Ah, katana missed you. Oh, katana, look how much look how much uh, easier it is to bring you I mean you yes, you wreck it. You dest destroy the package. But I mean it's oh, I really destroyed this package. All right, katana 1.0. Maybe you're not as good as I thought you were. Okay, let's see. That's that. I don't know who this is from. Um, it's a sticker trade. It says that right there. Let's see. St thanks for the sticker trade. Keep stacking. FCC Chris. Okay. All right. So this is FCC Texas or FFC Texas. Excuse me. So FFC Texas, another Instagrammer. Um, check them out. Cool little, uh, cool little sticker right there. You got the coins pack and style or packing up. You got the coins stacking up, and it says FFC Texas Numismatics. Cool. Okay, this one right here says um, Jay Parker, so that means that I know it is from Jay Parker Silver Stack Stacker, and I'm going right back to Katana 1.0. You know what I mean? We're bringing back the old school because I'm an old school that's so cool. Here we go. Ooh, patriotic. God bless America. God bless America. Ooh, okay, patriotic. I feel it. It's in my blood now. Jay Parker Silver Stacker. Man, that's cool with the Walking Liberties. You know that's my favorite coin, Jay Parker. You know. What's up, Spectacular Bro? I finally got my next batch of stickers. Took forever. I guess I gave them the wrong address. Oops. <laughs> Here's my sticker for our trade. I really appreciate the support of my channel. Thanks again, Jay Parker Silver Stacker. Well, thank you, Jay Parker Silver Stacker. And uh, love the Hallmark card. Love the patriotic approach right here. Love the sticker. It's going to go right here. Right here or so. Wait, hold on. You can't see that. Right here. So maybe like that. Maybe like, I don't know. Maybe, well, FFC is a little smaller. Maybe he can go down here by the mule. And where's my other one? Oh, yeah. So now normally I don't put more than one type of person sticker on there. But this is so epic of a sticker. I can't just like leave it be and just put it somewhere else. It has to go on the sticker board too. So it is what it is. That's an awesome sticker. Um, a few people have gotten that honor. For instance, Mooney Tucker with his awesome new sticker. I had to put him on there twice. He has another sticker over yonder that way a little bit. So every now and then somebody gets uh, two of their stickers on there because it's just so epic, 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 epic. All right, that was terrible. Okay, so... Uh, thank you so much to H-Town Stacker, J. Parker Silver Stacker, FFC Texas, and Hats Good. Hats Good, again, man, she, Hats Good, she's trying to look for some more subs, help her out, get her above that number. Um, she's going to be giving some stuff away. So show her that you appreciate that those giveaways by giving her some support. And, um, you know, thank you so much for the friend mail. This was fun. This was a cool little little unboxing right here and unpackaging and unenveloping and and just a fun time. Um, so friend mail is never something that you have to send. It's all just for fun. Um, sticker mail, sticker trades or whatever. If you got a sticker or something for your channel, send it to me. I'll send you one back. Or uh, reach out in an email, um, spectacular at yahoo.com, and we can work something out. We can send it at the same time, whatever, however you want to do things. Anyways, um, please thumbs up the video. Please uh, comment. Please uh, subscribe to Hats Goods. Uh, show her some love for what she's doing here. This is that was really cool, and um, I'll put a link to the other people in the description so you can get a hold of them if you want to look them up, whatever the case may be. At this point, spectacular is out. <laughs>